What is up guys? It is Farz here and today we are back playing some Farz Craft and whoa, 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 Who are you? Who are you? Who is me? Why am I Steve? Where are my pants? What are the answers to these questions? What happened? I know what happened. So, I was informed last episode without me knowing my pants broke and I was supposed to repair them and I forgot. So pants are gone, we gotta make new ones. And as far as my skin goes, my internet's down as I'm recording, so uh, I can't load my skin because it's from online. At least I, I think that's why skins don't load when you're offline because your skin comes from like stuff. I don't know. <laughs> Point is, when I'm offline and you have no internet, you don't get your skin. So I have generic Steve skin. But guys, we have plans today. One of them you already heard. We gotta get new pants and try to repair the rest of this armor so it's looking fresh again. The second thing we have to do is go to our idea board and look at some new ideas to find the second idea. We have a lighthouse. It is the most saturated Minecraft build of all time. Think of any world you've ever had. If you didn't build a lighthouse, well, that's, that's far-fetched. Any world you've had for like at least a year, if you didn't build a lighthouse, you're crazy. Because this is a common build and I'm gonna join that bandwagon and make a lighthouse. And then also ladder to top of statue. And that just means I want to make a ladder system going up to the top of my Farzy pigman skin statue. And I'm gonna show you guys that right now in case you're somehow new. Well, somehow. <laughs> Kid has a thousand subs and gets an ego the size of a whale. Speaking of, we gotta build a whale soon. But uh, yeah, we're gonna build a ladder system to go all the way up on top of that little head. That little, little, little head. And get up there and have a little view of the whole world. Cause that's gonna be the best view in the server. But the lighthouse may have some competition with that, so I don't know. But now that little dinky watchtower means nothing now. But uh, ba 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 ba. We have to clear out our inventory too, but let's start farming some XP first so we can repair our armor. But as I do that, let me guys say to you, this is kind of on my mind, and hey, it still works, yay. Kind of. <laughs> only, only one spawn. Wow, that's bum. What the heck? Let's see if any more spawn. I hope more spawn. There we go, that's more like it. So as I was saying, guys, this has been kind of on my chest. I want to kind of get it off my chest. I feel like on this server, we've been way too serious with the builds, like we're building like all these like perfect archways and like upstairs like these like, you've seen like the beat up like realistic looking medieval roads and like these beautiful houses. I think the impromptu house and the disco room are the only two rooms that like are really like fun kind of builds and not like super like... I don't even want to call it serious because it's Minecraft, but uh, as if like I'm being too strict with the build. I should be more lenient, have some more fun things. I think the biggest thing to note is how I have like walls around our whole little like kingdom town area. I feel like that's a little too much. I'm still going to make the build. Don't get me wrong. I'm not going to quit the build, but just in general, I think we should have more fun builds and like creative things and... That's why I'm gonna build the lighthouse, because that's something, it's big, it's colorful, it's not medieval. I think that's the main thing. I think I'm going way too medieval with the the server, and it just makes it look kind of bland, because medieval isn't, like, colorful stuff. So we're gonna try to just incorporate more color, and do, like, a hybrid, like, a medieval and, like, creative hybrid. So, we're gonna try that. I just thought I should mention that, because no one even told me anything. I just, like... I just kind of noticed, like, wow, we do a lot of the same, like, color, like, wood and stone. It just looks kind of bleh. So, there's my reasoning for making a lighthouse. But now we're gonna, as I said, farm some XP. So, I'm gonna let them actually gather up. I'll just chill here for a bit. So, I will catch up with you guys when I have a bunch of skellies rounded up. So, BRB. Alright guys, for some odd reason, a lot of skeletons are dying now, when they drop, like almost all of them. So I don't know, maybe there's something with like a mob cap, I don't know. But we're just gonna kill these guys now, so uh, boom, boom, and boom. Yeah, there has to be some kind of mob cap or something, because even the guys with the armor, they were just dying. That's really weird. Watch, now if a guy survives, now we're gonna know. 
Hmm. Yep, they're surviving now, so... I presume... Something... Is preventing lots of skeletons from bunching up together, and... That's awful weird, so we're gonna turn that off. I didn't really get too much XP, not enough to fix really anything. Dang. Um... Oh, crap, yeah, that's... That's not gonna help us, we don't have any XP- We need three for that. Three for that. Maybe even more for that, oh jeez, let me see. How much are we gonna need? No, wait, we don't need to be 30 to fix that. Okay, no, this'll work, this'll work, this'll work, I think. That was so weird, I- Wow. Some people in the comments of my skeleton XP farm, they were saying, like, uh, there's something wrong with the farm, and I was like, that's not true, but there might be something to that. Maybe it's not me, maybe it's the game mechanics. That's not bueno. So, if anyone made that skeleton farm and you had a problem with it, I apologize, because I just shook it off as, like, no, it works fine. You guys are just doing it wrong. But that, that's really not good. <laughs> Jeez. Well, I hope that's uh, not a recurring theme. That's all I'm hoping for. Uh, you need to go on the ground. And let's do... What, what am I doing? Over here. Bada boom, bada boom, bada boom. That's, that's great. That's actually really good. I'll take that. Now let's try and... Oh, that's going to break soon. Let's repair this helmet. If I can get the helmet out. <laughs> and let's go bajang. We need diamonds for that. Of course we do. Okay. BRB. Helmet, stay there. Hmm, and comment of the day, we gotta do that too. I didn't forget, just for some reason I did it in a weird order today. All right, let's pop you out, screw you doors. New recipes, thank you, <laughs> I appreciate the recipes. Okay, come on, let's make this work, please. Um, ba-boom, ba-boom, what am I doing, ba-boom, ba-boom. Seven? Oh my god, <laughs> no. There's one. Steve's looking beautiful, but I'm not Steve. And then one, two, three, four. And that broke. Okay, well, the ah, the boots are more important than the chest plate. That was dumb of me. <laughs> okay, let's quickly get a new anvil. Then we'll repair the boots, get full armor, then do the comment of the day. Because that's overdue right now. Da 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 that was so dumb of me. <laughs> very dumb, very dumb, very dumb. Okay, we need... How many is it? I'm just gonna take the whole stack. I don't know how many it is. New recipes. Well, thank you again. Much appreciated. Mm -mm -mm. And go... We need... How many blocks? I think just three. Three or four. It's definitely four. And I bet it goes like this, and like that, and like that. Or upside down. And... Maybe... What? How do you make this anvil? Maybe it was like that, but you just only three blocks of iron. I'm struggling today, guys. Boom! Okay, took us like ten tries. Place was, was my oh, t do we? And take the boots to get rid of the pickaxe. Go bajang bajang. And there we go. That's a beautiful set of diamond armor. Uh, let me put the lapis back. Where does that go? Right there. The leaves can stay on the ground. And let's go back and get a sign for the comment of the day. Which I keep mentioning, but I'm not doing. Uh, do, 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 and then you can stay right there. Where's my signs? And we're good. Okay, I'll meet you guys up top at the mountain. Alright, now today's comment is by Marco Mana. And it says, maybe llamas hate you. And that is referring to last episode where I couldn't get the llama under my control. Because Minecraft doesn't have that in the game. But maybe Marco's right. Maybe they just hate me. That's very likely. I'm a hateable person. But, Marco, welcome to the comment rainbow. I almost forgot the name. The comment rainbow. But next time, we're going to have a new color and going upward. Because this first comment strip is done. So, everyone, bask 
Sand Cookie, TMM, Gabrielle, Rayan, and Marco. You are the original five, the Fab Five, and now the rest of everyone will ensue. But I love you all, but you guys are the OGs right there. Okay, now, as I said, we're going to do ladder way. Do we have any ladders? We don't, but we can make some. Ladder way up into the pig man's head. The pig man, as if it's not even me. Oh, hello, Flint. Um, so ladder way up there, then we're gonna make a lighthouse. So, ladders, I believe, are a bunch of sticks, if I recall correctly. I need, like, probably 60, just based on how tall it is. Is it just that? Oh, that's all it is? I'm thinking of fences. Okay, this is easy to make then. Boom, and then just do a little more like this. 39, could that be high enough? I think that could be high enough. We have torches too, that's perfect. Now let's get up in that pig man. That sounds odd. Let's not say that again. This little, this has been neglected so much. Aw, oh, this has been so neglected. But, uh, we should put a diamond in there, because we, we have the diamond. Let's just toss one in there. Let's, why do we have this wood, cob, let's put it right there. It makes it look really cool. When you see a diamond in an item frame, you just know, like, you're ballin'. <laughs> okay, let's get up here, somehow. This is the hardest thing to mount, if I recall correctly. Or maybe not. This is kind of easy now. <laughs> and... We gotta make sure mobs don't spawn up there, too. So we'll do it from the back. So... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's eight. So we'll have to do... A two. Oh, that stinks. We're gonna need a two. <gasps> Is there mobs in there? Oh, careful. Let's be careful. We're good. Okay. So we can just do like this. Yeah, that'll work out fine. And maybe we should just do one. Maybe just do that. Yeah. Put some wood down here just to make it look nice. Uh, you. Come here. Okay, all this, and then you, boom, boom, toss some wood, because inside my shoes is wood, I wear clogs, <laughs> and now, I don't know, this may be really, really, like, just me being OCD, but this kind of bugs me how it's, uh, like, three there, four there, could I just do this, should I just do this, I think I should do that, to keep it wide open, and then we'll go... We'll just do one for now, just so we can get up there, and then maybe we'll do two sides to this. Because, I don't know, that's really bugging me. That's really bugging me. Oh, there is a mistake right there, you can already see. Oh, what? No, I'm so... Ah, this can't be here. Because this is like... Let me see. I think this is going to mess things up if it stays here. Oh, that's just... Oh, no, that's perfect, actually. I didn't even realize this was up here. Okay, now get more cobble. Fishing rod, get away. Oh, let's throw... If a mob was in here, I'd be dead. Like, I'd be destroyed. There we go, got some light in here. Let's put a torch right here, too. And then we... One more ladder up there. And we're just gonna continue this up with cobblestone, just so we can not come out, like, right at the start of the face. Just like that. And go straight up. Oh, it's cutting it close, but we're gonna make it. And we go right here, and please be good positioning. All right, let me just put this ladder down, and <gasps> behold that view. Oh, my goodness. That's glorious. And if I put that torch here, yeah, you can't see that if it's right there, I think. I think that will work out good. Maybe, like, one on each side? Or could that work better? I think that is good the way it is right there. Just we have the extra lighting. I want to try and squeeze it a little further back, maybe. Right there and right here, maybe. I think that's good. We cover the most ground with that. Look at that. You can see the whole kingdom. Look at that impromptu house. I love how that looks. Someone told me in the comments to make a pool up there, and I would, but that would just really make the second floor right there really cramped, so... Good idea, but I'm not gonna do that, I don't think. But thank you for the input. The boat. Oh, this is such a good view. I'm so glad I did this. Now that we're up here, good thing to talk about. 
where the lighthouse is going to go. And I think that's going to go somewhere over here because when we're... I mean, I could do it, like, on that little island, too. But I want it to be really big, and that's kind of too small. Down there is a little too far away for me. I feel like over here would be a great spot because nothing's over here, but there's a lot of land. So maybe do something, like, right over there. Like, actually, maybe... Maybe right there on that mountain. I don't know. We'll have to figure it out, but... Either way, we're going to make a lighthouse probably on this area. Maybe if I change my mind over there, but I don't think so. I don't like that position at all. Yep, it's going to be there. I've decided it's going to be there. Okay. Let's hop back down. And, you know, we're just going to close up that little mess I made. Just like that. Just keep it one. I think that's fine. And then, oh, can I put a door there? Oh, that'd be great. Let me make a door. And a crafting bench. Because we need more crafting benches, right? We waste so much wood in this world, it is ridiculous. Let's do... Boom. And boom. We just threw down doors at the beginning of the episode, too, so that's kind of embarrassing. And just like that. Perfect. And you know what will make more sense if I put the crafting bench over there? That way it looks like there's more space. Or it's more even, I should say. That is glorious. Great, glorious. Okay. I'd say this is good. That's a little weird, but this is English. This is a success. Let me see how that looks from far away. The door. <laughs> New boots breaking in very nicely. These boots, hope I can keep these forever. Because these boots are amazing. Like the helmet's pretty good. Chest plates, good. Pants are pretty good. Those fucking freaking boots. <laughs> I didn't mean to swear. I pride myself on not swearing. I just swore. Forgive me. Forgive me for I have sinned. Okay, well. Minus the unprofessionality, which is not a word, but now it is. These boots are freaking amazing. And that door does not look bad at all. It looks just like dirt almost. You can't really tell. And that works out good. Wow. I'm so mad. I think I've made it like maybe... 20 episodes without swearing. Someone check that for me. <laughs> but I feel like it's been a good run and I just ruined it. Wow, I, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I don't like swearing. That's not me. That looks so weird. <laughs> it looks like there's nothing there. It looks like it's floating. But that kind of makes it look even more cool. Look at this world. Let's sleep up here because we're close to it. This world is awesome. I just got to say that. So now, you know what, we gotta start getting some wool for the lighthouse, which I didn't even get any of yet. We didn't even start that, so I'll be back. We're gonna shear a bunch of sheep, see how far we can get. I'm hoping we can get enough to do it today. If not, we'll start it for sure, but I'd like to finish it. I'd really like to. So let's see what we can do. I'll be back in about 20 minutes. All right, guys, I am back, and as you can see, the wool turnout is not very good. These guys are taking a lot longer than they used to to eat the grass and regrow their wool. It used to be very fast. And it's kind of inefficient right now. So I dyed a bunch of the sheep. Like all the sheep that you see are sheared. They're either white or red. So about half of the whole population is white or red now. I made sure to keep at least one of every color. I think I have two of each color now. Um, but... Yeah, it's just not going to be doable to get all the red we need. So I was thinking about alternatives. There's like red clay. There's redstone blocks. I'm trying to save this. Is there anything else that's red? Look, this thing actually comes in handy for once. Well, not really though. Because <laughs> I didn't need to unlock everything, which is stupid. Wait, oh, show oh, oh, what was that? Showing all? Showing craftable. Showing all. Okay. That doesn't really help me. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, well, I refuse to ever use this thing. I hate it so much. I don't know what that's for. Maybe it's for people that don't know how to, like, craft things, which in that case, good for that, to help the community out. But for me personally, I hate it. It's just a hindrance. But let me see what else we could think of. I think there's no other alternatives, to be honest. We could do redstone, but I mean, that'd be all our redstone we ever got just to make a lighthouse, which would be... Plus, it, would, wouldn't, it wouldn't look good because it's not, like... 
a smooth texture. There's like lines, you know, those ore blocks, there's lines, so it won't look like it's supposed to be in bulk. Netherrack, no. No, I don't think we can do it. So we're gonna start the build, but we are most certainly not gonna finish it. We're gonna keep that there. I like to keep at least one of each in the chest. We know where it goes. So, off camera, <laughs> the dreaded word, the uh, words, off camera. Every time I say that, nothing gets done. But I'm gonna actually try off camera to get about two stacks of red wool, maybe three. We're probably gonna need more than that, actually, because we're looking big scale. But I'm gonna try and just grind it out and get as much wool as we can. Because in about 20 minutes, I got about 40, so that's about shearing one sheep per minute, which... It's not very good, so got to put some serious time into this world, but I'll do it because I want this lighthouse to look amazing. So let me do this. So I think we're going to do it possibly right here. Let me flatten this out. This is probably going to be way too small, to be honest, but let's just see how it looks. I can already tell it's going to be too small. If we can cut this down like really low, maybe it could work. We want it to be like as round as like one of those circles for the walls. That'd be a great size actually, yeah. Maybe even a little bigger than that, to be honest. I want this thing to be huge. I want it to be really big. Uh, hmm. This is still not really looking like it's gonna be a good size. Okay, forget here. We don't need to have it on like a pedestal like this, like the statue. How about... No, that's too thin as well. What's that? Oh. That looked really cool for a second. Okay. Maybe we just fill in some dirt and do it right here. That could work. This is a big area. Yeah, I'd say this is a good spot for it, even though it's not really on a beach. Oh, wait. You know what I should do? I should really check the other area first. The one we were up on top of the head looking at down that way. I... Pretty much said I wasn't going to do that, and I was going to do it here, but now that I'm actually down here in the action, it kind of doesn't look like this is the greatest spot. So let me see. Let's fill this in first. We have a spot. Boom, boom, boom. boom. Of course. Boom, boom. Boom. Mm. Boom, boom. There we go. Okay, let's go check over there. We need to get some ender pearls so I can just go whoosh and just, like, make it there. But, yeah, oh, we can make a little, like, dock here too that'd be kind of cool so many ideas as i was saying earlier i need to get more creative ideas like more colorful creative ideas because i want to have like like this kind of a build this is such like a cool little build it's one of my favorites even though there's nothing here just because there's color in it and it has the the whole like medieval floor too or medieval road so it's like as i was using earlier the term is hybrid between like colorful and creative with medieval and like like, kingdom-esque. Like, you know, that whole kingdom feel you see from, like... I, I don't even know what I'm saying, but you guys know what I mean. Hopefully. I hope you do. Okay, let's go over here, and please, fingers crossed, please, that this is going to be a good spot. That would not really work well. I mean, ugh. I don't want it there. I want to save that for, like, an island build or something like that. I don't want that to be there. Over here. The only problem is over here, we don't go over here ever. Like, that's, like, no man's land. Nah, we're gonna go back to the other place. I, I just have a vision in my head of that lighthouse being, like, over the top. You can see it from, like, here. And I just have that vision imprinted in my head. So, we're gonna roll with it. We're gonna roll with it. This has been a, such a... Delayed project. This needs to be done very soon. If I remember, we're going to do this next time. Well, that all depends on how long the lighthouse takes. But that needs to be done because that thing is ugly. There is nothing special about that build. And as if you guys remember, as you know, that's in a very awkward position because it's right next to the animal farm. So we need to, like, do something if you guys have any ideas for that, how to cover up that pipe tower, like, it's the same thing as this, only it's way smaller, but for this tall pipe tower, I covered it up with this watchtower, but over there, I can't make it, because it'd be, like, touching the farm, so I need, like, a, a really thin build that can cover up, like, 
some width, but not length. They're just like basically something that's long, but not wide, if that makes any sense. <laughs> so any ideas, let me know. Otherwise I'll think of something. Let's go to our place now. So we're going to go with a white, white, red, white. I want to do four layers of the colors. Let me just first use white. We have so much do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three. Is that too square? I think that's okay. It's a little bit square, but just because we have the three rounded edges, I think that'll be okay. So we're going to do this up by two, three, four, five. We can do five each. I'm just going to make a staircase just so we know. So five, maybe you want to do six. We'll do six. Okay, six. And at the top here, we'll do red. So this will go... I mean, we kind of know what to do now. Let me just fill in as much as we can. Six, that'd be perfect. And it'd just be going like this. So now, pretty much, we're just going to go like this and just try and mimic the... You know what? Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. And do another staircase right here, just so we know. So now we have the whole idea of how it's going to look down. So it's going to look very rough, but you're going to see, like, what the inspiration is in this and then like that and like that and one more is this yeah that's good and then we're gonna go like this and like this and like this and then like that now let's break all the excess and that should be good. That is a pretty good outline. So you guys can see like the height. That's not it though. We're going to double this up. So do like this, this, white, and then red again. So it's going to be pretty tall. Maybe even a fifth one. We have to check the height. But that looks like a good length, I think. I definitely think so. And it's not going to be like twirl, Or should it be twirling up? Ooh. Now, you know what? We're not going to do a twirl because that would just make things too complicated. We want a simple lighthouse that's going to look nice, and that will definitely look nice. So I'd say we have our framework down for next episode. I'm going to get a crap ton of red wool. Any sheep? I can't really see from here. We're going to do that all off camera. So you guys get the drill for next time. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Oh, it's Steve. So this, this is going to be a weird outro. I'm not a pig man. Okay, I'm gonna thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, and do all that good stuff, and I will talk to you guys next time. So until then, goodbye.